Hello, this is Andrew from Trend Following Mentor. In this short uh, video, I'm going to discuss the positions that I'm in that trend following from a momentum standpoint as well as a canceling standpoint. Um, today is the 24th of January 2013. I invite you to come look at my website. On my blog, I actually <clears throat> post positions and ideas that I'm doing for educational ideas. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to actually go through the charts now. I'm going to go chart by chart so you can kind of see what I do. First of all, what I do is <clears throat> I rank in Metastock the strongest stocks. I already did this, obviously. And these are the strongest stocks here. This one, DDD, CELG, CELG. And you can see them. I look at about, about 15, 15 of the strongest stocks. And um, I'm going to discuss some of them with you. <clears throat> First of all, I'm already in this uh, BCEI, been in it a while, and when they're breaking out, I'm trying to add a little bit more. I'm looking to buy a little bit more here. MACD is turning down, but you know we'll see what happens. Take it you know day by day, but I'm looking to buy here. As you'll notice, I have this uh, trailing stop called Trading the Trend. I wrote an article back in uh, 1998 or 99. And it's basically a volatility-based trailing stop that keeps me in the trade when the trade is working. Let's jump to the next one. Let's do Soda Stream. Bought some Soda Stream the other day, and it's kind of choppy around. It's not looking all that overly fantastic. <clears throat> you can see I bought a couple times. Um, let's see what happens. This is more where my risk is. Soda Stream is one of the strongest stocks. Seagate. You can see the concept again. Bought, bought, and then I want to see that it took out here. Had a big up day. I believe earnings are coming out. I don't really, I'm not getting into any of the fundamentals. But again, I have a hard stop down here and I'm just going to see what happens and following it. But again, Seagate was one of the strongest stocks. <clears throat> Qhu, it's a Chinese internet company. I'm looking to buy some more here if I can break out. Um, and my risk is down to here. Siljin, that's an interesting one. This thing took off like a rocket ship, and you know, realistically, I would be a buyer about here again at the highs. But I'd like to see a little bit more of a pullback. Um, I don't think that it's finished pulling back yet, and um, we'll see. But that's one of the strongest stocks. <clears throat> Tata, I got taken out of actually yesterday. I was in this thing for a while, and what's interesting is uh, it just completely fell out of bed. And it hit my stop. I was out, gap down. It's a big gap. Um, gave back a lot of my open trade profit, but you know what? Gaps will happen. And there's no way to avoid them. Take your small loss. Keep on moving. Actually, no. This was a little slightly of a, a slightly profitable trade. Um, I'm not in this trade yet. I want to see some more activity. What's going on here? And a little bit more. Um, it's moving up strongly. I'd like to see a little bit more of a retracement. <clears throat> for me to jump on board. Um, <laughs> I'm in this one and it's barely hanging in there. Um, it's one of the strongest stocks. It's moved up nicely, but I didn't get in here. Actually, I bought in here, bought out the breakout here. And if we close below this uh, trailing ATR stop, I'm out. Nothing to think about. Uh, let's see what else we have here. <clears throat> Western Digital, I'm in. Same scenario. You can see where I got in, and we'll see what happens. Um, this one I'm going to be probably exiting today. Been in it for a while, and it's just not working. And this is what the key is, that you have to honor your stops. <clears throat> Yesterday, it didn't close below. Yes, I mean, I'm sorry, two days ago it didn't close. I mean, I can almost to make to some degree to be a buyer here, but I'm not going to be because... I've closed below my trailing stop, my trend line, so it's negative. Also, the MACD is negative here. So, again, I'm out. I have a, a market order to exit on the open. Uh, what do we have here? Let's see. Eastman Kodak, I've been in this one for a while. Um, just been grinding it up. It's not a rocket science stock, but it's strong stock. Actually, it's in the uh, strongest in my ranking and this one's interesting this <coughs> whatever this 
Mexican or Meta, whatever the heck it is. But it's moving up, and it's not a lot of volatility. It's it's nicely moving up, and I'm following it. We'll see what happens. Um, Hertz, I'm in, and you can see I'm following it. The key is to really try to go with the strongest stocks and then and ride them and stay with them. Um, here, this is another one, Trimble. And actually, I'll be looking to buy this again if it takes out these highs. Um, the only problem is it's the, you have like a divergence in the MACD here, which isn't really giving it the most favorable. But again, we'll see. Again, this is Andrew from Trend Following Mentor. <clears throat> I invite you, I have a book, actually it's here, called The Bible of Trend Following. came out with Amazon. I invite you to pick up the book. Um, it basically teaches you how, you how I think and how I approach trading. Um, it's my trading plan. I also chronicleize it. Also what I do is I have these little e-books that are pretty much a dollar, most of them, that I... Um, have different ideas how to use an MACD, talk about psychology of trading, common mistakes, and they're pretty short, about 20 pages, but they're very powerful and they give you ideas, you know, how to, let's say, be effective. It's like cliff notes when we were in school, like how to avoid the next bear market. Very simple rules. <clears throat> how to use moving averages. Most common trading mistakes that stock traders make. Again, they're on Kindle, they're a dollar, I mean, most of them. And I invite you again, I think really to give you the strongest basis, is this book, The Trend Fallen Bible. It'll teach you a lot of things. Had 17 reviews. Um, again, I invite you to come and learn, and that's my goal. I thank you. Again, this is Andrew from Trend Following Mentor.